Hello Internet, it's me Jeff, and this is my boy. Aaron is behind the camera, and today we're gonna make his first little jack-o'-lantern. For his first Halloween! For his very first Halloween! Yay! So, first of all, we're gonna go ahead and take the top off this guy. We're gonna take the biggest knife out of the little, like, prefabbed carving kit that you get when you roll on over to the store and say, ah, hey, I want to carve a pumpkin. <laughs> It's very important to just show raw bestial strength in front of your child <laughs> so that they know what's coming. Yo, I just took the top off of this one. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and chop off this little guy right here. I have a plastic bag at the bottom and a dog as well. And we'll figure out what happens with what. Now that we got the top off, we're gonna go ahead and take our, our scoop. <laughs> There's Riley. Start attacking us. Jamie, look! Look at what Dad's doing. Of course, as soon as I said that, he looked down. <laughs> ah. Feels kind of mushy, doesn't it? He likes it. Mm. <laughs> Wait, 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 does he have anything in his hand? Please take that from him. Okay. Mm. Pumpkin time is over. Thank you. Oh, there's a seed. There's a seed right in the middle of this. Yeah. If you want to get a nice, good carve out, you should make the hole bigger than what I did. Because <laughs> I can't put anything in this guy in there at all. Which is why I brought the not part of the kit ice cream. Ice cream, the trusty ice cream scooper. <laughs> to get that top layer on off. Ah, yes. Basically, I am wedging my hand in there and then making the pumpkin spin. Uh oh. And that has got quite a bit. Our dog is going to town. I read somewhere that dogs can eat all squashes and gourds, so she's just <laughs> having a field day. <laughs> we still got a bunch more pumpkin to bowl on out. Hey. Riley, don't eat the pumpkin guts. and then scoop out the bottom part. Jamie, look! base has a little bit of a uh, flatness to it so that you got something to rest your thing on. Pick our side. Got ourselves a little bit of a guide right here, so this will be pretty good. 
take our marker and take one triangle. Two triangle, three triangle, and big old smile. Hmm, that might be a little bit too low. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a a mark right up here. And heighten this there up. There we go. And then this mark right down here. Which line are you gonna follow? Oh, follow the lines. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and take the medium one. <laughs> and do it. One triangle, that's the eyeball. Jamie, look! Yay! Okay. <laughs> You're not as excited as we are. No. That's okay. Realize that these eyeballs are kind of tiny, so this triangle gets extended a little bit over here. All right. I'm gonna do a second triangle. I'm gonna make this one a little bit closer than the guy because these guides are just that. guides, <laughs> not right. cops. You don't have to listen to them. Wow. All right, get this. Here's the nose. Yay! going to start just outside of the eyeball. Wait, don't you want to... it's gonna go underneath the nose. I thought you were gonna give the jack-o'-lantern a tooth. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give him a tooth on the bottom. Just like how our little baby got it. Yeah, his one tooth. <laughs> Looking like Tommy Pickle. Uh, tooth is on. Alright, yeah, give it a little smile. Alright, it's on your right, so the jack o' lantern's right. So we go underneath this eyeball, and then once we get to the eyeball, we go hard up, hard to the side, hard down, and then back into the big old smile shape. Yay! And we take all of these guides, little water rag, and wipe all that down. Oh no. What happened? Mm -hmm. ah, I was wondering if uh, Sharpies are permanent across jack o' lanterns or not. <laughs> it's spooky mascara! Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mommy loves you. <laughs> He's like, no, I'm trying. Go ahead and take the last knife and just as a way to get some use out of it. Thanks. <laughs> Bye. Bye, guys. Happy Halloween. <laughs>